Greetings, this is Professor Fiore. In this sequence of videos, we're going to be looking at DC electrical circuit theory. The only prerequisite we really need here is a good grounding in algebra. There's no other background in terms of electricity or electronics required. We're going to be using the free OER textbook on DC circuits that I wrote, along with its lab manual. So these videos will parallel those. Uh, you can use other books, of course, but this is sort of designed to dovetail with those. Where do you get them? Well, you go over here, mvcc.edu, Mohawk Valley Community College.edu slash jfiori. This will land you on my homepage. And right down here, we have a list of the OER texts that I've written. So we can come in here and we have a whole bunch of these nice things. Um, there are a couple of mirror sites that I do maintain that has the same list. I'll just jump over there. You can see that. So it's the same exact list. But for us, we're going to be looking at this DC electrical circuit analysis text. And then there is a lab laboratory manual that uh, echoes it. You can get these in PDF format. You can get them in ODT format, open document text. That would be used on OpenOffice, for example. And you can also get low cost versions in print. Uh, if you click this, it'll take you out to Amazon, uh, low, relatively low cost, uh, $11.50 here for the book if you get it in print format. But again, PDF, ODT, these are free. So here's our PDF. I'm just gonna scroll down here just to give you an idea of what it is we're going to be looking at. So we're going to start off here with basic fundamentals. We're going to look at scientific and engineering notation. That's a key element. And very quickly, we're going to jump into the basic quantities defining uh, what electricity is, so to speak, current, voltage, power, terms you've probably heard of, but maybe don't have a really good definition. Then we're going to jump into series resistive circuits, look at um, basic rules, Ohm's law, Kirchhoff's voltage law, move over to parallel resistive circuits, uh, the more complex series parallel resistive circuits. And we look at a series of analysis theorems and uh, techniques such as source conversion, superposition theorem, Thevenin's and Norton's theorem, things along this line. Uh, we get into net, uh, mesh and nodal analysis. Now, to save yourself a little time on this section, it's very useful if you have a calculator that does simultaneous equation solutions. And then we look at uh, reactive components, capacitors, inductors, and magnetic circuits. That rounds out the book. Okay, so this is about a 400 page book, but as I said, it is free for the download. So I'll just randomly pull out a page over here. There's exercises at the back end here but you can basically see what's going on. Uh, this is set up in eight and a half by 11 format. So if you do want to print parts of it, you can, it's easy enough to do. It is in color. Um, most of it's in black, and white, but we do have some color elements here. All right, so eight and a half by 11, easy to print out sections if you're so inclined. Now, as I mentioned, there's a lab manual if you're interested in that as well. So there's a series of labs that echo the text, right? Resistor color code, Ohm's law, series parallel circuits, the theorems and such that we mentioned before. Um, and yes, there is a uh, print version of this, All right? Okay, that is what we are looking at in this course. So, our next video will launch right in and start looking at the sort of foundations that will be required for success. Thanks.